welcome to Kural Kurs. And it's And today, I'm gonna show you how to install a graphics card into a computer. Okay. Things you need. You must have a computer. Second, you must have a graphics card. And make sure before you purchasing a graphics card, make sure you you try to measure your casing dimensions from inside. If your casing is too small, you can't install graphics card like this. You will stuck some in somewhere. For example, this card could be installed in this one. Wait. In this one very easily because it has a lot of clearance up to here. Sorry, I'm a little <laughs> Anyways, I could tell you like this. So, okay. First thing was you need to get off, get off your PC from your desk, then put it down, remove the cover from here. This is Dell T3500 It's a gaming machine I will review about it in some video or sometime soon okay so next for the cover off make sure you have enough power supply for your PC if you have not enough power supply for your PC then you can't able to run anything at least you need to have supply installed up to 500 or more than 500 watts or so. This is a gaming power supply from Dell which has this kind of gaming uh, weight. Which has this kind of gaming connector and it is a 525 watts power supply. Here, um, wait, turn out the light. I hope, uh, focus. As you can see here, model H525AF means it is 525 watts. And most graphics card need up to 400 watts max. And the larger card may need 700 and more. So this card is GTX 960, 4 gigs, 3 fan edition, got out from that one to that one. And yes, I will be reviewing this graphics card that I purchased for this computer, of course. And uh, so, next begin. It's very easy. Make sure you have cleaned up your PC using this door. Okay, so first step, remove the cover as I did. Second step, if you have any old graphics card installed, it is easy to remove. If your card is larger or smaller, first you have to lift this up. Push this and lift it up. Every PC have different ways. This is Dirty Pack Saw. Means Dirty 3500. Wow! Amazing. It has built in gaming fan. There are two, two fans here. Wow, nice. Okay. So, I already removed its graphics card. This is what, this is what it came with. It is 1 gigabyte AMD Radeon HD double five seven zero and uh, DirectX 11 of course. It ran some games okay. Anyways, and make sure before purchasing your graphics card, make sure you have checked the following thing. Some graphics card need two six pin character. Sometimes some need it 8 pin connector. So make sure your supply has it. Okay, so my supply has only 6 pin here. 
and I need to have two six spring here as you can see there are two six spring in this one so I bought this I bought this from nearest shop okay. so this is Saka 2 Saka Power 2 8 wing I have to turn on the light so you can see this this is Saka 2 8 wing connector for the um, car graphics card ok I uh, wait so it's really simple So next is car graphics card. Be very careful. Make sure you have moved every wire out of the way from the machine. Move this connector up because we need this. And once you have enough clearance, then remove one of these things. And okay. Swing is simple. Just get this into position. As you can see, it, is, it has a lot of clearance. For this. Look at it very slowly as I am going. I am hoping, I am hoping that I am getting in this video very correctly. It is doing with one hand. Don't. So, as you can see. Wow, what the hell? Why are you coming on my way, loser? So, okay. So, be very careful. Uh, uh, okay. Finally. I got, I guess. Let's see. Yeah. It kind of sits. We have to move this card in order to see. Oh no, it is not set. We have to remove it again. <laughs> Wait. Doing it again. Just very carefully, as you can see here. I'm seeking this card straight, straight down. Uh, now sit snug and tightly into the system. Okay, that's how you can see this graphics card. And wow, it's just a lot of clearance in this. Okay. Let's make that connector into one of these. Where is? Here we go. See. Oh my god. One hand work is really, really suck. <laughs> I do not want to pause a video. Man, sit inside. Wow. Okay, take a side for a bit. Cards, wires. Let me do this on focus. Okay, finally, uh, uh, are you serious? You do not want to sit inside? Oh, finally, get thick. Okay, remove one of 
का एक विंग कॉस्ट भी डॉन एट वन एट विंग हेयर इट्स वेरी ईजी सिंगाई डेबल सिंगाई डेबल कनेक्टर ओके अब वेट सिंगाई डेबल कनेक्टर जिसे सिंगाई डेबल कनेक्टर ये आगे का हाई मोड ओके वन सिक्स पिंग गो सेयर और सिक्स पिंग Go here, and I have to wait for Azan to run anyway. So, we're starting quickly here. Okay, wait for a moment. Uh, where is that cable? Okay, so here you go. There is the cable, and yes, uh, you have done your work. Make sure removing all the wires on the back of this, and yes, sorry for this happened here. We can't do anything about it. Okay, make sure you squeeze all the wires as I did. Okay, and uh, I have to install that card back anyways. Where should I put that card anyways? So, uh, install that back. Okay, and install that back as well. This is extra graphics card. Uh, not graphics, but extra hard drive connectors. Okay. So those guys, if it is not closing, I guess it is not going to close. Yep. It is not going to close. But anyways, I get it. Wow. And close this. And close this. Oh. I'm using the wrong way. No, 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 no. Wait. I'm using the wrong way. No. Why? Okay. I'm making it sick. This. Okay. Stuck something. Let's go ahead and complete. Wow. This cover doesn't want to close. Wow, RIP force. This force is too great. I guess I have to keep this open, man, because the cover is not closing. Okay, so I have, I guess I have to get this open, and this cover is losing us. Anyways, the problem is this thing. I don't know what goes in this way. But that cover may stay loose. One more, I try to try one more time. But it may knife easier. After happening this, this may make my knife very easier.
tree so it knocks like this it doesn't close because now that metal is here the metal is in the way okay so let's check the display pc is here let's turn it on So I pick it up. Here is a resting guy. Okay. Oh wait. Okay. So yeah, I know. Um. Okay. So what? Okay. It's okay. So first. We go to Windows 7. Same for Windows 10 anyways. We have to install driver and wind up. And this thing is here. This guy keep like a saw, I mean guy keep a keep like one drag. So here is the card this way. Here you go. And then here is a driver. Next thing I get external hard drive into this. I have the driver. I don't need to download it. But if you want to download the driver, it's really easy. Simply you have to Google for your graphics card driver. If you have NVIDIA, just type NVIDIA drivers. If you have AMD, then type AMD drivers and make sure you are downloading the official driver from NVIDIA if you, are, you have NVIDIA card and if you have official AMD if you have AMD card you make sure you are downloading official AMD graphics card driver okay so let's install very simple Let me show you something. Here is a PC. With Xeon W3550. You see where it's no longer being used. With us. Okay. And make sure you have uninstalled the previous driver. Seeing it simple. We were in, um, installing it. Wait. It, it, it have to check the driver first. Quick, quick, quick. Quick, quick, quick. Quick, quick, okay. So I pass this. But before this. You have to install your previous driver from the system and oh no, I am opening the wrong ones. I don't want to use Urdu language here. Wait, what? It's okay. This thing is simple. You have to remove this AMD because I have removed that AMD pass small card which it was come with. Okay, so. Okay, so we are removing that car driver. We try again. Okay, just go to control panel and program some features I get. And we can send it all and uninstall it. It will delete all the drivers, which is not 
it is unusable wait a moment it will delete it itself okay we tell we tell this happens wow only 19 percent uh, it is stuck for the moment i am doing this because if you don't in uninstall your driver previous driver it will conflict with the newer ones Yes, I do have to restart it. I have, I just checked this driver. If it's okay, I have to restart the computer in order to get back. Okay. Okay. Even it doesn't say you to restart, but you have to do it. Wait. I will be back. I wait. This is starting. I always show full videos because I get a reason. I do not need everything behind. It should be very long video as expected. Okay. This will take long, so wait. Okay, now let's begin. Let's go again on Windows 7 quickly. Okay, here we go again. Okay, you sing a symbol. Um, we start the driver. Huh, once we start it, okay, it is already extracted, so don't need to re extract it again. So what uh, uh seriously this <laughs> this set of dingeeks the angry I guess we have a set of files nice incredible Yes, um, this is the older version of graphics card driver as my guess. I need to update it, but for now, I am showing the test. If this works. Basically, that Xeon is first generation in the i series. Because it is equal to Core i7. 920 but not 920 but uh, more of than 980 if if there is 3 giga processor of i7 maybe 980 it may be close to that okay agree and continue for some years Yes, but oh, I'm not mean because I do not want to mess with previous drivers. That's great news. Very tracing, but my AMD RX 5 uh, maybe my AMD RX 550 XT may do some kind of ray tracing, I don't know, but I have to figure it out. Maybe AMD did may make a ray tracing graphics cards. Maybe. So, 
so it's based on your PC speed and hack but it doesn't take on the external hard drive yes it may take a while Okay. I ignore this garbage that shows in Windows 7 as always. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Who cares? So, antivirus. Anyways, I will install it. No problem. So, this GTX 960 is successfully worked on Dell T3500. That's incredible. This card uses 500 watt X Max. X Max power. Okay, so we start all as always. Then you will see the full screen graphics card. And I don't know if it works with better with 4K, so I will be testing that in a 4K. Not in Core 096X2160, but 38 Core 0X2160. Okay. Hmm. Incredible. That works, and that is passed. Okay. So that is a huge success, as you can see here. You, as you can see here, and you can call panel. If you want to, if you want more proof, um, go to your manage. And yes, um, and second is and you can call panel is here. If I open this, it should open. And yes, here is a device manager. And yes, here is GTX960 installed here. And for more, uh, here it is. It is working. And let's see how much it draws for my. Okay, so it's good. And the fan is still running because the casing is closed, so the reason the fan is running. I guess now it's stopping, anyways. And fan PWM is 0, 0, uh, 20, 22, 22, which is okay, kinda okay. Same for that AMD card as well, so that is all for today. Thank you for watching and have a nice day and hope you like this. Kinga Sangai.